you make yeah, it to the IFL. The so now you're actually seeing a decent check for a fight, but the level of competition is night and day. It's what you're used to. I was so blown away that I was going to be able to just guess, fight out of state, you know? It was in Connecticut, the Mohegan Sun. Everything's new to me, right? Every, like the whole thing. I travel by myself because they all travel from Tucson. So I go to the airport in Phoenix. They're on different flights. I'm, I'm, at, the, I'm at the airport in Connecticut for a long time waiting for them. They get in and Don Fry is hammered drunk. And in Connecticut, they stopped selling beer pretty early, I, I think like 10 or whatever. And he's just like, God damn, where can you get a goddamn beer around here? And he's just freaking out, wanting some full beers. No, which I get. Because when I did drink, when I drank, I was like him. And he he just had us going to all these different places, looking for beers. They kept telling the same thing, like, hey, homie, we stopped selling at 10 or whatever. So it was like, I could tell, like, it was a, it was going to be a real fun weekend already, like, just because Don was making me laugh. Some guys were annoyed, but I thought it was hilarious, you know? And and then... Oh, you're used to traffic it, too. Yeah, we... It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what your niche is. Like, nobody's perfect, right? Everyone's got something about them. And it's like, I can handle that because I've had so many of my people in my life like that. I can handle those guys all day. Um, Which I definitely got to touch base on that later with my Jesse Forbes... Or, or not Jesse Forbes, uh, Jesse Taylor an Ordul story, but, mm -hmm. um, you know, there were so many guys, there was like, all the, the all the pit bulls were there. Um, so the pit bulls were Henzo's, Henzo's team. Yeah. Uh, Carlos Newton hit the dragons. You guys were the scorpions. I think there was one other team. I'm not sure what it. The Wolverines. It was the Wolverines. Oh, the Anacondas. Not wolves, the wolves, too. Wolves, like the Oregon wolves or whatever. Or, yeah. uh, Cause Chael Sonnen was there. I remember the first time I saw Chael Sonnen. I didn't know him. I didn't know shit. But he looked like a funny dude. Like, he was just always laughing and shit, you know? And I was like, man, like, what's it? This dude kind of looks like uh, this This dude kind of is a, is a different looking individual, you know? Like, he don't look like he'd be fighting. He's real. real. And back then, he was real young. And they had a member at Matt Horwich. Oh, dude, he was a wild man. Well, he was really smart, though. He's a little socially awkward, but he was real smart. You could tell, and we were. He's on, good. Like, he's good if you could get him to, to 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 shower once a month. That's a that's a that's a serious issue in a jujitsu gym. Is you gotta you gotta you gotta wash your body as a as a service to the community. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah, and you're 100. percent But I liked him. He was a little socially awkward, but I liked him. And Dom was again hammer drunk the next day, and he had a fucking. He had a he had a outfit on that would make Donald Cerrone. No matter what Donald Cerrone was wearing, it would just put him down. He had a sick ass like cowboy shirt on, and he had a he white. Had, like, did he have the string tie, like the shoestring? Mm -hmm. No, nah, it was it was just it was like three buttons down by then because he was three sheets past it, you know. But he had all this turquoise, this crazy ass jewelry on, and he was fucking he was he was ready to go. And we're all sitting in the lobby, <laughs> and he was drinking some cold beers. I mean, Boss Rootin's there. You got all these crazy famous people there. And I don't know how – I didn't know how it happened at the time, but <laughs> Matt Horwich comes up to Don Fry with, like, a list of groceries. And he's, like, real socially weird, you know? He's like, hey, Don, can, can, can – you're going to the store, key. He has money and, and a list. And you're, can you give me some, some bread and some meat? I want a sandwich. And Don Fry looks at him and goes, you think this is a fucking game? <laughs> I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm like, what's happening here? Dude, Don jumps up and like starts taking his jewelry off. Like I thought he was going to straight scrap. And Chael comes over laughing. And Dennis Holman. And then they oh. try to break it up. And Don pushes one of them, and then him, him and Hallman almost get into it. Like, this big old fight almost erupts. I guess Chael Sonnen 
uh, Horowitz was like, I need to go get a sandwich. And he's like, go ask Don. He's going. He was just like, fuck it with Don. <laughs> so he was like, he was like go gooning him all the way back then. You know, like it was such a crazy, all these people just getting ready to scrap. Like eight. Check out the full interview on iTunes, Spotify, and all major podcast platforms.